MHP Gardener recently did a video where he was complaining about aphids, and I told him that he might consider getting a plant called Gaura. That's G-A-U-R-A. -A. Uh, it's a flowering plant, and it's perennial. Um, this is one I have, and I think it's three years old now. I need to divide it up. Uh, it's about four feet around. Um, but last year, I discovered that this plant was covered with aphids, just absolutely covered with it, but yet I didn't have a single aphid in my garden. So this is a great trap plant for aphids. Um, I have one inside the garden and one outside of the garden, and what I did was I uh, killed the aphids off of one, and uh, I figured any that I missed might run to the other plant, so I would wait several weeks before I sprayed the other plant. And um, I think I did that twice and killed off all the aphids. And yeah, I know that um, ladybugs like aphids, but I've only seen three on this plant. There's one right there. But um, this is just a bigger job than these ladybugs can handle. And I'll show you what I mean. This. I don't know if you can see this or not because my camera doesn't do close-ups very well, but everything that's pink on this uh, stem is aphids. And they are, they, last year they were just covered. These stems get about three feet tall and they were so covered with aphids that they were almost the size of a pencil. Um, but almost all these new shoots have aphids on them. So I want to see if I can kill them off before they multiply too much this year. And oddly enough, with all the aphids that this plant had last year, it didn't seem to affect it. It um, bloomed beautifully all summer long. And that's one of the great uh, parts about this plant is that it blooms all summer long. And here's one. It just started blooming. And I believe I have a picture of it when it was in bloom last year, and I'll try to attach that to this video. But it's a beautiful plant and um, a good way to trap aphids. So I don't know if you can see those. It's just covered. And it's just the beginnings of it. So, uh... That's one way to get rid of aphids. Hope it helps.